Welcome to First at Four, I'm Tim O'Connor. And I'm Kim Stevens. Well, footy's back and no one's more excited than Tim here. He spent the last two weeks putting together our 56 page annual football magazine. What can we expect from it this year, Tim? Yeah, well, it's all the, all the same um, leagues are covered again this year. We've got the, the VFL, uh, which 11 clubs uh, comprehensively covered with a page dedicated to each, um, as well as the Central Highlands Football League uh, with their 18 clubs. Um, each page has uh, ins and outs for each team, um, a chat to their coach and a bit of a story outlining how their chances are going to how they're going to go this season. Um, the VFL, the Rebels and the Maryborough Castlemaine competition uh, is also heavily uh, covered uh, as well as the, the netball from around the region. Uh, I've also got draws uh, for all the competitions around the area um, so there's plenty in there for all the, the football and netball lovers this Excellent. year. Excellent, thanks Tim. Also tomorrow our court reporter Evan Schumann brings us a story on a mother in court today. She was caught drink driving nearly five times the legal limit with two kids in the car and Rachel Affleck has a story on two welfare providers in Ballarat, Best and Brace, who have announced a merger. And for more footy in sport, our former Rooster and New Cats recruit Oren Stevenson is almost certain to make his AFL debut this weekend against Fremantle. So for all that and more, don't forget to get your copy of tomorrow's Courier or go online to thecourier.com.au.